If you're a content creator, this is a must-have for creating content in your car while you are eating your lunch and talking to TikTok, while you're waiting for somebody to go into a store, while you are traveling and creating content on the go, this is a game changer. It is a very small device that actually nestles in between the car headrest poles and allows you to mount your phone and move it at different angles so that you can see whatever you need to be filming as you are going. So let me show you how this works because this is a really nifty device. This is a really helpful device because it does move at a wide range of angles. You can actually tip this up and down. This piece does not come attached, so you have to attach it yourself. All you do is unscrew this, put it on this little lever right here. You're then going to attach this part to this part, move it up, and then make it tight so that it stays where you need to, but you can untighten it and retighten it based on how you need to be moving it. And then you can see it's going to actually be able to fold right up against there. You can leave it there if you want. You do have to leave the headrest up. It cannot go all the way down. And then you have the ability to just move this as needed and you can get the full range so you can move it however you need to. I'm sitting in the back so I'm facing it toward me, but I can actually do this on the other side and just flip around to see the front of my car. And with that, especially on the passenger side, you just have a beautiful um, landscape behind you so that you have the ability to have a really cool video. Now, this is great because it's just a retractable bar here. So you're just going to be able to push that very easily. And it is going to then fit on any of the headrests that you've got in between those bars. And it just holds it into place there. There's a little bit of foam on the inside here so that it's not going to damage your car. And then it's very easy to just, again, fold that right up and go. You can take this off if you're traveling so that it's just the more flat piece here. And you can just clip your phone in it. You can turn it horizontally or vertically so that you can use it in whatever capacity you need. This is really helpful for your content creation because you can just mount it on the car and create your content. So if you're driving, you obviously are keeping your eyes on the road. You are not endangering yourself or people around you. But if you're the passenger, if you're in the backseat, by all means, create that content. If you are parked and waiting for somebody, create that content. If you are eating lunch in your car on your lunch break, create that content content. But this also works for a lot of other reasons as well. You can mount your GPS so you can put that on the passenger side and you're able to then look over to it if that's what you need. If you want to keep it out of the way of your windshield, you have the ability to put this on that headrest in the back seat like I am right now. I usually travel with my dogs in the back if somebody else is driving. And so I will sit back here and I'm not able to create content or to do things without having that here. I'm going to be a, a, a co-pilot on an upcoming trip, but I'll be in, again in the back with a dog. So this is going to allow me to mount that phone without having to hold it the entire time. And you can leave this in the console of your car. You can just leave it there permanently. You can attach it to the headrest as long as it doesn't bother the person who is driving or if you are the person in the passenger seat and you've got it in the front so that you've got that really pretty windshield version of um, a background. As long as it doesn't bother you, you can just leave it right in place. You can put it in your bag and carry it with you. You can keep it in your car somewhere. Very easy to store, very small, not in the way. But I also really like this if you are traveling with people in the back seat who are going to be distracted or need to not be a distraction on the car ride. So if you are letting your children, if you're letting your adult friends who are hanging out with you hang out in the back seat and watch TV or scroll on their phones, this is going to be a good opportunity just to mount that and let them watch that TV, stream those shows to play on their phones without having to hold it, without you having to worry. It is just there and out of the way. And then you also have control of where those arms are going to be. So you can move it to share it between the seats. You can move it so that it's facing away. If it's it's something that they're going to be watching at night when it is too bright. We can turn down that brightness and we can move it over so it's out of the driver's way. All of those things are going to be incredibly helpful. And you can tip it at different angles. You can move it around so you can kind of just see how we've got that nice flow. And if you are doing something where you are filming content, you can then get the different angles. So if I were creating content, I might film a section this way so that I'm over by the window. And then you might see me move it so that it's got the car rest or hide seats behind me and the dog seat belts behind me. Then I might go over to this side. You can see how I'm doing it at different angles in different ways so that I can create content that is actually going to have different looks to it. Now we've had a conversation about other car headrest pieces that you can be using to mount your phones. But they're not quite as functional or flexible as this one, but we are going to do a comparison video. So some people will gravitate toward this one. Some people will gravitate toward the other one. Check out the other review videos and the full playlist of technology that content creators absolutely need 
need in order to level up your content to save time and effort so you can make more money but spend most time doing it there's a full playlist here on the channel and let me know if there's something i need to check out because i will absolutely do that for you and check out the comparison video to help make the right decision for you cost wise they're about the same it's not like a huge difference so it's really about what's going to be most functional for you so we'll see that in an upcoming video plus daily videos helping you navigate the world of your content creation to make it easier for you to thrive in this space and become incredibly profitable with less time less effort and a lot less stress we'll see in the upcoming episodes